Everyone has ego. But the person in his spiritual journey must try to get rid of his ego. So, what can a seeker do to get rid of his ego? First let us know what ego is. The word ego means I or self. When a person only cares about himself then it is called an ego. But the spiritual person is not one, who only cares about himself only. He wants to spread the joy all over the world. But the person with ego only thinks and does anything for his own benefits only. And in spirituality we live for the welfare of the whole world, so this ego is not good for the spiritual journey. By the end of this video you will know how we can remove ego. Please show us some love by subscribing to our channel. Number 1. You and your ego are not the same. Many people think that ego is the part of who they are. No. In the spiritual journey, your goal is the union of yourself with the divine. And an ego cannot let you do this. So never misguide yourself saying ego is the part of me. Number 2. Don't think about ego. Imagine how much you waste your time and energy, just by thinking about ego. When you think of the ego, the ego will manifest in your life. So just pray to God and think of pure divine within yourself. Number 3. Think about your life without ego. This is a technique of thinking your life is ego free. You don't have any ego in how you perceive the world around you. The more you practice this, the faster you can remove ego from your life forever. Number 4. Having humility in the heart. When a seeker has humility in his heart then he will not show his ego to others. There is still an ego in him however he will not show the ego to others. Number 5. Realization of spirit. When a person thinks that he is not this body, he is not even the mind, he is the spirit, he is the divine and everyone is the spirit same as me. Nothing to judge others, we all are the same. If this feeling comes to a person then he will be free from ego. Forever. Thank you for watching. May God bless you in your spiritual journey.